welcome back to my channel so check this out don't forget to like share and subscribe hey AG Vaughn Jamaican welcome happy new year this is what's going down for the new years we're gonna do a seafood boil I got the shrimp I got the seafood fiesta I got the crayfish got more shrimp I got lobster tail I also got the potatoes okay I got my time that I'm gonna cut up Put the time in here. Got my onion. Okay, I'm also using the Cajun seasoning. I can't put the name because I don't want to get a copy right strike. Got my black pepper. Got my garlic powder. I'm gonna put the onion in the thyme. Everything has been washed and everything in the pot. Now I'm going to go downstairs and I'm going to get a pimento um, leaf from my pimento tree. See I'm doing this step by step. I got three leaves from the pimento tree. Drop in my pot. Now, I'm going to let that boil. Before I do that, I'm going to put a stick of butter. And that's in my water. Let that boil. In the meantime now, I'm going to wash my potatoes. And that's the red potatoes. Alright, my potatoes are done wash. These are the red potatoes. Just drop them in the pot. Let those cook down. When those cook down, and get the right, you know, way where I want it to cook, then I start to put the seafood in. But until that cooks down, I'm gonna give that 25 to 30 minutes, let it cook. Then I'm gonna start putting the seafood in. Okay, earlier you see me put all the seasoning in there and I put a stick of butter. You know what I'm gonna do now, since the potatoes are boiled, I'm gonna put a little bit more garlic powder in there to give it that flavor. Got another stick of butter here. And I ain't gonna forget. I'm gonna put a cock soup in there. Got these washed already. I'm gonna put some scallion. Take out any more. 
water or if I need to add any more water. I'm gonna save this. Okay, I'm gonna put this on the side. I got 10 more shrimp. Remember, shrimp and lobster don't take long to cook. And when you see crayfish with the red color, that means they've been pre-cooked. I think I think I've read just about enough water. That's perfect. Stir it up. this cook down uh, I'll do it about 10 10 to 12 minutes because you don't want to overcook lobster and shrimp you don't want to overcook those things I'm just here washing out what I used Garbage goes in the garbage. So are you done? You don't have a mess. You don't have much to clean up. But where I have this, it should be done in 20 minutes. No more. No more. If you do it longer than that, you're gonna overcook it. Next thing. Next thing that can make you overcook your food, especially seafood, when it's cooked, don't ever, ever leave it in the water because the water is still hot. The water is still cooking. Always take it out of the water. That will also affect it. So, I'll catch you back in the next. 15 minutes. We've been having everything in there for about five minutes. Hey, this is the end result. Look at this. Look at it. Look at it. Now I'm ready to dig in. If you want some. Give me a thumbs up. I'll send you some. Hey, thanks for watching. And you guys have a good day. And till the next one. I hope you enjoyed the video. I would like for you to check out Princess AGTV. Also Life with King and Shay. And I want you to go and check out my man, The Smoking Bear. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. That's very important. Please subscribe. Thank you. Until next time.